Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Agave Talk, your number one source for everything agave. We appreciate you being here with us today. Today, we are actually reviewing Agave Mix. <laughs> yes, so Agave Talk, reviewing Agave Mix. This comes from a company called Citra Fresh Premiums, cocktail mixers and enhancers. And we have both an Agave Margarita Mix and Agave Paloma Mix, all right? So we're gonna showcase the bottles and then we're gonna mix this up and review how it tastes. So, this is their Agave Margarita Premium Cocktail Mixer. Um, this is a heavy, heavy bottle. Loving the feel on this bottle. Looking at the back, get that in focus. Um, kind of their little story on the back. For all my carb conscious people, 14 grams per serving because their recipe is three ounce mix to one ounce tequila. Um, looking at the ingredients on there, it's just filtered water, agave nectar, lime juice, lemon juice, some citric acid, and they're basically saying three ounce of this to one ounce tequila, maybe even top it off with a half ounce of orange liqueur is what they're recommending. Uh, looking at the neck right here, sweetened with 100% agave nectar, uh, cork up at the top, really nice packaging on that. Uh, margarita mix coming over here to the Paloma so again that Citra Fresh Agave Paloma mix premium cocktail mix on the back we have the story again this one is 17 grams of carbs and uh, the ingredients filtered water agave nectar some citric acid grapefruit concentrate and uh, yeah it's looking like the the recipe is the same three ounce of the mix to one ounce of tequila this one says garnish with a lime wedge serve and enjoy and looking at the neck the same kind of branding going on so what we are going to do is we're going to mix these up according to the recipe and give you our thoughts and with some movie magic we'll be right back with some drinks all right everyone we are back we mix these up according to the recipe on the back which is basically three ounce of the mix and one ounce tequila we chose to use a blanco tequila we love mixing with blancos especially if we're doing a margarita or a paloma um, just kind of really brings out both the taste of the agave but also leaves a great chance for the mix to come out as well so we're going to give this a try this is the margarita cheers mm. Ah. Mm. super refreshing mm -mm -mm. definitely refreshing you're getting a lime on there it's not super intense a nice sweetness is that agave nectar Definitely that, uh, that agave nectar on there. Look again, looking at the ingredients. This is a margarita filtered water, organic agave nectar, lime juice, lemon juice, some citric acid. Uh, <clears throat> we did not put a bit of orange liqueur on top. We just really wanted to try this on its own um, with the recipe that, that they recommended. Mm. Yeah, that's not bad. A lot of, a lot of mixers, especially margarita mixers, are way too sweet. They're like neon orange. <laughs> I mean, neon yellow. It's it's weird. Neon green, whatever you want. It's uh, you could tell this is not that. It's a little more natural. So I'm digging that. I'm digging the margarita mix. Not bad at all. Mm. Let's uh, take a sip of this Paloma. Cheers. Got that little pink hue to it. And let's see. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, wow. Oh, that grapefruit is right up front. Definitely a lot more grapefruit than lime in this. You you don't, you get, oh, man, yeah, you're getting a lot of grapefruit in there. Mmm. Love Palomas. Mmm. 
Oh, wow. Oh, it's not bad at all. It's got a sweetness to it, but uh, you're also getting that tartness of the the grapefruit, which I love in Palomas. <laughs> yeah, that's that's not bad. And the same thing, we just followed the recipe on the back. Basically, three ounce mix to one ounce tequila. Um, and again, the the ingredients right there. Yeah, that's not bad. Honestly, I don't know if if I'm picking the two. I think I'm I think I'm going with the Paloma. I like that. What I would do, I would recommend, and I'm probably gonna do after this. I wanted to do, uh, you know, and give exactly what the recipe called for. I would probably do two ounce mix to one ounce uh, tequila, or if it's the three ounce of mix, add an extra ounce of tequila. Uh, tequila kind of gets lost in there, and honestly, we drink a lot. There's pros and cons to that. So <laughs> I, I, I think we would end up adding an extra ounce, three ounce uh, mix, two ounce tequila, and especially with the Paloma, we would top it off maybe with some Topo Chico, a little bit of seltzer water, something like that, club soda, absolutely. But wow, I'm not usually a fan of mixes at all. We make a solid margarita here just using agave syrup, lime juice, and tequila. Uh, but these, both of these, are solid choices. I'm, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm happy with this. Cool, Citra Fresh. Thank you. Very happy to be able to try these out, and um, give them a try if you ever see it. I know they're in Total Wine, so that's it for us. We appreciate you being here today. If you have not done so already, hit that subscribe button and like as well, and follow us across all other social media channels. Thank you so much. Take care, everybody, and be safe.